Good morning, guys. Today for work, I had to wake up at 5 a.m., which actually ended up being a really peaceful morning. I started by making my bed. I had my clothes laid out from the night before just so that it would be easier for me to wake up and get dressed. And then I did my hair. I curled it using my curling wand. And I don't always get ready like this for work, but I just figured since it's the first day back, I might as well look cute and look my best. And this was the finished product. I really like how it's turning out with my curling wand. I sprayed it with my hairspray, used moisturizer, foundation. I used some concealer just to cover up any blemishes, used bronzer, blush, I really like this Anastasia blush I've been using, and then highlight, eyeshadow, the naked palette, and then I put on some mascara. This just came in one of my Ipsy bags. It's pretty small, but I'm going to get some after it's all gone. And then this is the Pillow Talk lip combo. It's so good. I used some of my Chanel perfume. And then I put on my earrings, and this is just the everyday thing for me whenever I actually do my makeup. I got my water bottle ready filled with ice and water, and then I've been trying to, you'll see how this feels in this video, but I've been trying to make my own cold brew at home because it saves money, but usually I end up just going to Starbucks because I don't make it as good as Starbucks, but at least it's the thought that counts. Someday I'll get it right and not have to go to Starbucks. So then I ended up leaving at 6 a.m. for work. Good morning, guys. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am actually not as tired as I thought I was going to be. I love my job here. Probably one of my favorite jobs I've ever had. I get to work like on all different kinds of events. Today I'm here for, it's some type of exam or test that a certain major has to take. I woke up at 5, I got here at 6.30. I'm staying till 12.30. I'm a senior at Liberty. It is like very, very weird actually being the oldest here. Weird because I feel like I just got here i'm probably gonna go for a little walk here in a little bit check on this event and kind of go outside because the view is really really pretty on campus this morning definitely need to get some homework done today honestly i feel like i used to be really scared of like how it would feel to be a senior the first couple months it was weird but now it's kind of at the point where it feels right and i'm like planning so much of my life after and focusing so much of my energy on that that being here doesn't feel as right as it used to like it kind of feels like a little bit abnormal but i think that's how it, it should feel like i don't think i should feel comfortable staying here unless i was like supposed to stay for my masters or something i have so much stuff in this purse i got this purse for christmas a couple years ago campus looks so pretty right now The second day a week two for my classes so i'm starting out with my business classes is personal finance i am going to go more in depth about my classes in my next video i really actually love all my classes right now and i know i say that every single semester but this term in particular just has some bangers so this is personal finance and then i also am in personality psychology and interdisciplinary studies which is my capstone i honestly love all of my classes right now and i'm really excited to do them the rest of the semester but i'm just looking at my planner right now and i'm just like i'm a little bit stressed out for the semester and i'm only going to be in lynchburg for three weekends for this whole semester times like these make me so appreciative that i'm an online student because this year is really crazy and i don't know what i would do if i was actually like in person in classes so yeah i'm really thankful for a very flexible job a very flexible schedule a very flexible online schedule a very flexible work study also if you guys didn't know this job that i'm at right now is my work study i'm really thankful to be able to have a job where i can do school work that's typically what work studies are but it's just so so nice to be able to work at school be able to do school work while i'm doing work it's just really really nice and this year has been so good i'm really trying to hang out with more people though at this semester during the week whenever i am here so i've been trying to reach out to all the people that i really want to see get coffee with lots of people because that's really important to me this semester anyways back to the grind so when i say spreadsheets we're talking about the balance sheet so whenever you go to the bank to get a mortgage or a car loan okay guys i am back from work now it is about 12 30 right now and i'm gonna make some lunch i've actually been meal prepping i meal prepped yesterday for this whole week i didn't typically used to do that whenever i wasn't losing weight but now that i am it just like makes it easier for me to plan stuff better because if i know exactly what i'm gonna eat i'm not tempted to eat something that 
I shouldn't be eating. Basically all I did was yesterday I had cauliflower pizza for dinner and I saved, I only ate half of it and saved the other half for lunch today because this kind of goes bad, not goes bad, but it kind of goes stale quicker than most pizzas. So I'm gonna have that stay for lunch. But I also made chicken and put like a little bit of garlic in it. And now I have two full Tupperware things of chicken. So what I'll probably do is I'll probably make a chicken salad tomorrow for lunch. Honestly, I, I really need to eat this chicken like really fast because I leave on Friday. So I also sliced up some cucumbers. I'm gonna have some cucumbers with it as well. Honestly, meal prepping, I've never done it before, but this is so helpful. Okay, so this is what it looks like. I'm gonna put some ranch right here in the middle. I use the Olive Garden Parmesan Ranch and just enough to where it gives it a little extra flavor because I don't wanna use too much of this. This isn't the kind that I use, but this is another kind that I found. It's the Newman's Own Cauliflower Crust. I used a different kind. I got two different brands because I want to try both, but this is one that I found at Kroger as well. Hey guys, so a few updates. I was just on the phone with my friend Maddie for like an hour and a half. She is one of my childhood friends that I went to Disneyland with and it was so good to catch up with her. And we just talked about Disney for like literally an hour and a half and Harry Potter and parks and stuff because we're planning a Disney trip soon. I also went to Starbucks a while back and got coffee because my plan for making cold brew to not spend money just kind of failed because I just realized I can't make it like they make it at Starbucks. So this is an Irish cream cold brew. So good. They don't have it on the menu yet, but ask for it. And I think that it's back, but they just haven't like announced it yet fully. My, one of my roommates is coming to pick me up. I'm going shopping with her in a little bit. I think I'm gonna make dinner first. I have my hamburger meat defrosting. I'm gonna make burgers without the buns. We're all going to karaoke night at this sports grill kind of place in Lynchburg. So that will all be really fun. Right now it is like the most beautiful golden hour it's so peaceful. I have my little candle going. Okay guys, I'm terrible at cooking, so don't judge me, but I made a burger and I seasoned it with like garlic and salt and pepper. And so I'm gonna have this, I'm gonna have salad with cucumbers on top. And then what I do whenever I go to Chick-fil-A, I love their avocado lime ranch. So I always get some of this whenever I go, but I usually only put like a third of it on my salad because it's just like, I mean, it's 300 calories total and this is like a very big packet so this is typically what i do and i think i'm gonna have a pickle i got these don't judge me for this also but i got like this huge jar of dill pickles because i used to have these all the time as a kid and there are zero calories so i can have all that i want and it's totally fine All the roomies back together. Ah! We're going to I'm here. here. I've been awake since 5 a.m. Am I going to karaoke? Oh, Ava. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, so I came back about 9 and started doing my skincare at 9.30. I've been trying to get into bed a lot sooner, so I do my skincare a lot sooner and then I can get into bed sooner. So I use this cleansing oil just to take off any makeup and just to do the first initial cleanse. And then I use the Kale and Green Tea Spinach and Vitamin Super Fluid Cleanser by Youth to the People. It is so good. It makes your skin a little bit dry, so if you have drier skin, it may not be the best. I'm actually working with Duval Radiant Spin Care System in this video, and if you use my code Alan Cash, you'll get 70% off, so it's normally 90 something, and it's 20 if you use my code, so definitely go use this code. It's amazing, comes with all different brushes that you can put on it. It's waterproof, so you can take it in the shower. It takes off so much dirt and oil, and it's honestly just so, so good for getting off all the dirt every time i use it even if i don't think i have anything on my face it still takes off so much dirt so definitely go check them out and get a spin care system and use 70 percent off i'm next using this fresh toner it has roses in it and i'm getting to the end of it so it's mostly just roses so it's already get it out now but i used that and then i've been using the tatcha moisturizer i am so close to being out of that so i definitely need to go pick up some more but i always in the night with moisturizer because i always want my skin to feel very glowy whenever i wake up and then i finish with this rose quartz roller i love you guys thanks for watching